Isabel, what are you counting? Oh, so you just the train stops? Is, oh, nope. got it, got it. So that's what you're keeping count on your fingers? How many more stations then? Two. Two more? Gotcha. Happy Sunday over here in Paris, and it is our, also our last day, which is very sad. We really love this place. It really has um, captured a little part of our hearts. So, just like when we were in London last week, we visited HTB, um, Holy Trinity Brompton. We are visiting a local church here, which is Hillsong Paris. So I believe the 10 a.m. service, which is actually a bilingual service, so English and French. So uh, yeah, we're really excited. We've been to Hillsong in LA as well. And so we're gonna go catch a service there. So come along with us. And if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe and click that notification bell as well so that you catch all of the videos that we post on this channel. All right, let's go. Found what we're looking for in life. Was crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. All right, looks like we found it. Uh, so Hillsong Paris is in this place called Bovino Theater, and so they've got a theater here, and uh, so they use it, I guess, kind of like a mobile church, you know. So they use a theater, but then they get all set up. And here you go. You know their famous sign, Welcome Home. We are here at Hillsong Paris in Bobino. Um, just looking at some of their uh, stuff that they put in between seats, which is very cool. We're at the English service yep. uh, so that we can understand what's going on. Um, so far we've, we put Isaiah and Isabel into the kids program. So yeah, that'll be fun. It's a really nice theater. Uh, that they're in. Uh, all the seats are really comfortable. It's, <laughs> it's a, like red plush seats. Yeah. Like two level, like small uh, kind of theater. Alright, we just wrapped up at Hillsong Paris, uh, really good service, uh, really quite interesting because it's bilingual so they had um, the pastor and then I guess an interpreter, she probably is a pastor as well, I'm not sure, but uh, she, <laughs> she, uh, he had an interpreter that was interpreting in French um, and then uh, the message was from Brian Houston, uh, video. Uh, through video and uh, but it, it had always had translation the worship was really interesting too because then they had mostly French like four songs in French and then one song in English and then there was always um, both English and French on the screen so uh, really cool really cool experience you know obviously we recognize a lot of the worship songs and the message was really strong and and Justine what did you think of the service it was good it was good yeah they uh, had a good message and they were very accommodating um, in terms of showing us around and knowing that we were first timers there. So, highly recommend it if you're in Paris. Okay, so we are making a quick stop and grabbing a crepe. Uh, there's so many crepes here. Oh. <laughs> Aww. Uh, there's so many awesome little crepe shops here in, uh, in Paris, so just grab one. Grab one every day, maybe three times a day. Uh, they're delicious, right? What's your favorite kind of crepe? It's um, mushroom, cheese, and ham. Nice. It's so good. Oh, then! Or instead of ham, chicken. Chicken? Oh! You know. Oh, steak chicken! The cheesiness when you bite into the bread, it's just, just delicious. It's delicious, it is delicious. How about you, Isabel? What's your favorite kind of crepe? Nice. Strawberry banana Nutella crepe. That's Isabel's favorite. Isaiah's is ham and cheese. And my favorite kind of crepe, I think, is Nutella banana and strawberry. What do you think of that, Isabel? That's my favorite too! Boom! Woo! Matching favorites. Matching favorites. 
Ah, ah,